Classic quads and US topos. Today we're looking at the difference between these two types of topographic maps you can find on the MyTopo website. Let's start with similarities. They both cover the same amount of area, seven and a half minutes by seven and a half minutes. And they have things like uh, roads, contour lines, water features, and so on. They have the section lines, which are one square mile. Now, US topos do tend to be more up to date. In general, they were created within the last five years or so. Classic quads can be more like 30 to 40 years old. And just as an example, you can see this area. There are no roads here on the classic quad. We come over here and the road network is shown here. Also, US topos tend to show road names in a lot of areas. Classic quads really don't have that many road names. Both types of maps do have contours. And in general, they're the same contour interval. Now on the classic quad, these are from scanned original USGS maps. And so in some cases, uh, the lines might look a little bit thicker or thinner. And the US topo, this is the same area. You can see the contour lines are just a little bit cleaner and they look a little bit nicer. Classic quads in some locations have a whole bunch of little dots that indicate where the buildings are at, individual buildings. But the US topos in general don't have anything like that. The US topos and classic quads show trails. However, since the classic quads are quite a bit older, in a lot of cases, trails may have been rerouted or created completely and may not show on the classic quads. As far as overall look, US topos tend to have a very clean, organized look. Classic quads are very nice as well. They tend to have more of a classic feel, almost like a historic handmade feel. But in any case, we offer both for sale on our website, mytopo.com.